situation for coaches, and we're, we're, we're figuring our way through it. And of course, the biggest priority is keeping kids safe. And I think we, you know, it's always been that way with injuries, but now we got the added part of the virus in. So not only are we worrying about injuries to their body, we're worrying about a virus. And, you know, and the unknown part of who they go home to, and, you know, some live with grandparents and trying to make sure their parents feel secure that we're we're doing the best we can here of keeping things clean and you know, that adds some that adds some extra time and effort and people team is first winning the region championship you know we want to be first in the region because you know usually the state championship right through our region going good you know i've been pushing the guys we, you know we got a lot of youth this year but you know me me other leaders on the team like Kenny and Derek we just been pushing everybody on defense and offense you know so i feel like we're gonna have a pretty good year uh, we've learned over the years like you know we learned from our failures from past years i think that's what makes us different from any other class so you know we just know what we need to do to get to the state championship. <laughs> you no, know, we, we used to be getting disrespected these past years, but uh, we're going to shock a lot of people this year. Uh, it's going to be great. We're going to knock a lot of people helmets off. <laughs> <laughs> do you like your new region you're in? Uh, yes, sir. You know, I'm, I feel like it's better because, you know, we don't have a game where, like, you know, we play like a team that's not good. Everybody can beat us, but we can beat all of them easily. So. Good job. Fun. It's really fun to be out here with you guys. Uh, first day in pass, a lot of hit. So it's real fun right now. So just enjoying it for the most part. You got a lot of familiar faces back on your defense. What's that going to be like this summer? Uh, that's, that's really big. Uh, with a kind of a newer offense, we really need that defense to back them up and stuff like that, just to keep them up and you know what I'm saying, get them going. Yes, sir. And uh, you know, when your first game comes up in Oct uh, August 21st, what's some of your emotions going to be when you hit that field? Uh, excitement, nervousness. And uh, just pure aggression, yes, sir. And what sort of goals for your team this year? Uh, state championship. That's always the goal, yes, sir. Good deal. Oh yeah. Hey, a lot of versatility and power that we have up front and our smartness that we have with the linebackers and the DBs and the safeties to recognize the players and stuff like that. That'll help us not only with the young guys, but just being the hump, like going past the second round and the third round and like that and get to where we want to go with the state. You know, when you're teaching some young guys over there on your one-on-one -on -one drills, what sort of your responsibility as a starter and what do you need to do to get them to, to sort of emulate what you're doing? Um, I help me and uh, other Dan try to help them with their stance and their ball get off and just their relentlessness and just to keep going back and just keep going back and um, punch them in the mouth every time. Is it harder for the young guys on technique or just what do you think their number one thing is a, a young defensive end needs to learn? I think it's their technique and like just coming from middle school, I think they're overwhelmed. Cause that's that's how it was when I first got here. But as the season goes on and practice goes on, I think they should um, warm up to it. It's a hike. Can do everyone good. It's been going great, uh, you know, kind of being back with the team and all uh, high energy, you know, with the restrictions, uh, you know, got to take precautions. But as far as being out there with the team, it's been awesome. Coming into fall camp this year, you've got a lot of new faces on the receivers. And what do you like about your receivers this season? Yes, sir. I feel like, you know, we're, you know, all the guys are about the same, but bringing a little, a little something different to the field. 
Uh, I know we're young out there, um, but I think they'll come a long way and, uh, you know, be the underdog. When you see your defense playing so well early, what's that do for you, your confidence, even in the, on the offense? Yes, sir. You know, I think I believe we have one of the best defenses in the state. Uh, got a lot of great players on that side of the ball, uh, and, and going out there and facing them every day is just going to make us better. And, and you know we're going to perform better on Friday nights because of it. Do you have to, have to uh, sort of get coached to say, "Hey, Justin, come out a few plays here on offense"? <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know we're going to have some special things. We, you know, mixing in defensive guys on the offense, offensive side on the ball. Um, but you know, right now we're just introducing everything, trying to get the game plan down. I know everybody's team goal is to win a state championship, but what what is your goal for this team? You know, I want to I want to be the best year possible, senior year, go out with a bang, uh, state championship, region championship, uh, perfect season. Got to set the goals high. How good is this senior class that you're with? I think we have a very talented senior class, one of the most talented in a while. Um, and you know, we're excited for our our last year, and uh, got to realize it's our last time, so we got to leave everything out on the field.